if you're new here don't worry it's awkward we need to get to know each other and if you're a returning subscriber hey it's i don't know why i do that my sister hates hates my intro i'm like you get paid to do that <laughs> Anyway, Alhamdulillah, today is Thursday and welcome to day 10 of the Ramadan weekly vlog. I can't believe it's been 10 days of Ramadan, like fasting and everything. Alhamdulillah, it hasn't necessarily felt like 10 days, but it has felt like a consistent few days of routine. And I'm really, really um, grateful for that. But today, I broke that routine because I'm not fasting. I'm not fasting today and I have really, really bad cramps. I have really, really bad horrible back pain like my back is shaking in its boots <laughs> like lower back pain it's so so horrible but it's not like as bad as like bad bad that i can't function i just popped some painkillers and i'm currently editing the vlog that just went up <laughs> the vlog that just went up today thursday or to you it went up three days ago so if you haven't watched that vlog please go ahead and watch um that vlog i'd really really appreciate it I'm still having cramps, so I'm going to give myself a few more minutes in bed to just let the painkillers kick in. And as soon as they kick in, I will stand up, do my dishes, do everything I need to do. I think maybe I underestimated the power of the period, or I underestimated not fasting or like going off of my routine because after spending the whole day in bed, indoors i was just so tired and weak and i was like you know what let me just pick up my laptop and go and study and work from the mocks because if i'm surrounded by people even if i'm not praying i'm listening to like the tarawi then recite quran it can just help like in lifting my mood and everything like that I stopped at the Aquan to get a pho, which is basically just like noodles and vegetable broth because it was already past time for iftar and there was not like leftover food at the mosque so I just bought that and took it to the mosque instead. I don't know if you noticed if you didn't notice that actually hurt my feelings but anyway on sunday i didn't post a vlog that's because i haven't been vlogging because i haven't been fasting the first four days i was like i don't know what happened but i was just very very irritated i was just very very weak i was just very very tired and i just could not pick up the camera so i was just like you know what there's no need for me to pick up the camera and make a vlog that i will just hit editing and i wouldn't want to put out there so i was like now nah, i'm not going to vlog i'm just not going to post on sunday so i have the lad today is tuesday which is ramadan day 13 if i'm not mistaken oops my bad today is tuesday ramadan day 16 alhamdulillah i'm still not fasting but today is going to be the last day i'm going to go to the mosque for trawi inshallah but um before we do that i need to go to work i also need to film content before i head to work so i'm going to be doing my makeup with you it's don't worry it's not anything serious i just wanted to do my makeup and just you know talk to you a little bit and just see what's up and just say a few things that i haven't said in a while i don't know we'll see Previously, I wanted to do like a Q and A on my TikTok. I'd be like, "Oh my God, you guys should ask me anything you want to know, and just anything you'd want me to answer on my YouTube channel and things like that." But just like, nah, I'll just ask myself questions. <laughs> also, yeah, I'm just going to put all the product that I'm using on the screen so you know like what it's about and if it deserves an honorable mention. I'll mention it. I think two days before my period and like three days into my period, I was so irritated every single thing set me off i was just so easily disgusted by everything and at first i was like why am i so angry what is happening and i don't know why but i just did not want to associate it with me being on my period because i was like oh i don't want to give into the stereotype that oh my god it's because you're on your period you're getting so emotional yada 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 things like that but the thing is it was because of my period that i was getting so irritated in my head it was just like oh my goodness dan don't say um it's because you're a woman or it's because you're on your period they're emotional but like it shouldn't be a bad thing to me personally i 
thought it was a bad thing i don't know why and it takes a lot it takes a lot of stress on your mind it takes a lot of stress on your body so it's normal for you to be irritated it's normal for you to have these like brain fog and things like that me personally i don't have brain fog but i do know it's a symptom for some people i just decided to go easy on myself and just be like babes relax you're normally not this irritated and it's not because you're not fasting that like you're forgetting your dean that's why you have become irritated and just cursing at everybody relax you're going through some emotional and physical changes personally i don't know how those hijabis do their makeup on tiktok and just don't get anything on the undercap i'm just using an undercap that i don't mind getting dirty not the undercap that i'm going to wear for the day lately i've been thinking about like the kind of content that i share on social media not just youtube itself but tiktok instagram pinterest basically all the platforms that i'm active on i remember i posted on my tiktok i was like oh my god what kind of content do you guys want to see i don't want to do that for just tiktok i want to do that for youtube as well so like what kind of content would you want to see outside of vlogs and one thing that i really really want to do is like my build a modest wardrobe with me and I do that on TikTok, but there's just so much things that I want to talk about in terms of like how to build your modest wardrobe, how I went from having like one pair of jeans, thrifting and other things to like not having the best wardrobe, but having something that I can manipulate and get like two months worth of outfits before like having to repeat a complete outfit over again if you're not too sure what i'm talking about in terms of like the modest wardrobe series i'm going to put a link in the description so you guys can check that out and see the videos that i had in mind so basically that but long form as a hijabi when you're buying an item you're not just buying the item you're buying the item like oh my goodness does this item go with my hijab because if it doesn't go with your hijab i don't think there's a need for you to like get it and when i say hijab i mean your modesty does this outfit not only fit my aesthetic but does it fit my modesty like is it the level of modesty or is it the level of modest that i want it to be so yeah let me know in the comment section if you want to see like actual long-term fashion content on my youtube channel because i genuinely do want to create it this is meant to be like my simple no makeup makeup look but don't worry you think it's much but it's actually not much let me finish first by the time i put everything together you'll see that wait where did the makeup go what did you do <coughs> i can't breathe <laughs> shish don't distract me stop talking you're making me like nervous What do they call this? Waterline? Tight line? I have no idea. But I'm lining my eyes. We're not done yet with my eyes. We're going to do one more thing. We're going to put my bronzer underneath it and just smudge out the liner. We're going to only do it at the edges. Okay, beautiful people. So this is the final look. I just finished filming content for TikTok and mashallah it came out really good it came out really good i filmed a um, hijab tutorial basically how I wrap my um, chiffon. I'll link that again in the description so you guys can check that out point let me turn on the lights now real quick so you guys can see what my makeup looks like underneath the light i'm pretty proud of myself because my makeup has looky come a long way if i do say so myself <laughs> i hope you guys can see properly but this is the way the makeup look turned out i want to quickly film one more video for tiktok it's a fashion video kind of like a get ready with me for work and errand because i just realized i have one and half meeting to attend um, anyway let me film my outfit video for work slash errands and then <laughs> we'll head out oh oh it's squanted content has been filmed alhamdulillah i want to do a quick clean up head to work have some lunch because i did not have breakfast i don't know what's wrong with me and then do that one meeting and then come back home and then shasha you will see Honestly speaking, when I stepped out, 
it was sunny it was a little bit windy but it was nice and then it started pouring and i realized that while i took an umbrella i didn't wear coats i just like took my scarf with me i was already dreading the fact that i was going to get so wet and i was going to get so so cold Immediately I stepped into that bathroom, I took my bath, washed off my makeup, did everything that I needed to do. My knee is in pain. Why is my knee in pain? Because it rained today. Apparently, the cold got into my like system because now I cannot feel my knee and I was I was so like psyched up, I was so happy, I was so like, oh my goodness, I'm going to go and pray um Tarawi today because I'm back to praying and the rest and now my knee is in pain i turned on my heater i have double socks on but the way my knee is in pain not just my knee but like all, all the way to like my hip bone it feels very very much numb and i don't know what to do i'm still going to go to the mosque obviously but like it is in pain ya allah hopefully it's not raining outside because if it's raining outside i will get colder and I will like feel more pain in my knee because yo what I didn't even stand that much today. I didn't even stand though. Let me carry my gloves just in case. I didn't stand that much. Oh. Seriously paining me and I was really really so excited to go and why are you crying? Wait, I want to call my mommy. Yeah, he won. What kind of school system? Wait, wait, before you. <laughs> I want to like. <laughs> I used to eat anything and everything. <laughs> Okay, Wait, don't cut it. I am waiting for it. Yeah. yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Um, yeah. Because I'll need to we just wanted to give him some. Oh my god. Oh, okay. <laughs> 